Hey guys, Quiv the Lazy Geek here, and today it is Christmas. So for those of you who celebrate it, Merry Christmas. And I just wanted to share a little bit of an unusual video. We're not going to learn anything. Uh, we're just going to look at people discovering the joys of astronomy. Because back on Monday, I was looking at the conjunction of Jupiter and Saturn. And I actually got some guests to come over and go and check it out. It was the first time I was meeting them. They are basically a family of YouTubers <laughs> who live like a couple of blocks away from my place, a few minutes walk. And uh, their YouTube channel is about life in Japan in general. It's a very well made, very well put together uh, YouTube channel. And uh, yeah, I'm, I mean, we took the opportunity to just get together, have a look at that conjunction. And, you know, I love sharing the joy of our hobby with others, obviously. I mean, otherwise I wouldn't be doing this YouTube channel at all. So um, with that, we had the, uh, the dad was there with three of uh, his daughters. And <laughs> yeah, it was fun because they're still fairly little and uh, i think everyone had a lot of fun we looked at jupiter we looked at the moon we had also a quick uh, glance at mars and i just have like a hodgepodge kind of the reactions of the kids mainly uh to you know discovering the uh basically the planets and the moon through the uh the telescope so it's completely in random i mean it's not in random order but it's like it's not structured in any way it's just i hope it can you know it really brought me joy to see those kids just like, you know, look at these new things that they haven't really seen before with their own eyes. And, you know, I thought uh, I wanted to share that uh, joy with you guys. So um, enjoy. Well, he's been very generous with us tonight to let us come and to check out the alignment of these planets here. Right. See, the star back like there. See, yeah, those... Beck and Anna and Sarah, they saw it. Who saw it right away? I don't even know if this will get it. Yeah. Oh my goodness, it does. Nice. But very kind of shaky. And you can see it's actually two stars. Yeah, you can see so that. Who has very sharp eyes and tell me that there's two points of light there? Yeah, there is. Wow. Can sharp you see? Eyes. Can you see that, Anna? So that I know. That there's is two that. of them. How yeah. about you, Sarah? Can you see what we're looking at, Sarah? Look. Right. So if you look at the computer, this is what we're going to look at. This is a live view through the telescope. Wow. So we have two planets in there. Wait, is there a circle on that planet? Uh, yeah, planet. so you can see this, this planet there. You can see it has rings around it, right? Yeah. And you'll be able to see it directly in a moment. Mm -hmm. So that's Saturn. <laughs> and this one there is uh, Jupiter. And Jupiter is much brighter. Can you see there's a dark kind of streak there yeah. that's actually the clouds of jupiter so you're looking at the clouds of another planet that is crazy <laughs> which is i think pretty cool <laughs> that is really cool so now i'm gonna put this this is like a big mag magnifying glass like if you look inside it's just a big piece, piece of glass we're gonna put it in there and this telescope the telescope there if you look at it from the front you can see there's a big mirror in oh there oh my goodness right <laughs> i got so big my face oh, my exactly can you see it so there's a big uh -huh. mirror in there and i'll, I'll, I'll help you see it <laughs> come up oh you're heavy she's heavy oh you're heavy can you see it yes so that's a big mirror so you might have to adjust the focus for your eyes because it depends on your eyes but i think you all have very good eyes <laughs> what, what you'll see is one planet with rings that will be saturn you'll see the bigger planet that's round and it will have four stars around it those stars they're not stars they're moons of that other planet that is awesome Let's have a look all right Who goes first can you see something can you see it sarah okay look straight down in there and you'll see like a point of light you look down in here like this like yes. that do you see do you see yeah. yes do you see things yeah, yeah. Oops. Whoa. oh that's more like the reaction I want. Yeah, yeah, that's... that's <laughs> oh my! Isn't, Isn't that, that so cool? cool? My turn. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. You were patient. Finally, your turn. Well done. Yeah. Oh, wow. It's 
It's awesome. It makes us feel small. Yeah. Can you see it again, Daddy. Yes, you, you can. You want to try it again. it again? Yeah. Okay, we'll let you try it again. Okay. Like I'm surprised only see that, that like the last time this was like that. It was like Wait, 800 it's... years ago. Do you know how old I was 800 years ago? <laughs> <laughs> right. Let, let's go towards the moon. One of the things as well that you need to understand is that the Earth rotates, right? It, it yeah, turns it on itself. So that means that the sun will move like that. The moon does the same. When you're using a telescope, because the Earth moves, we actually need to track the stars. And so this telescope is always moving to counter the Earth. Yeah. Oh, Spoiler good. alert, it's awesome. <laughs> <laughs> well, I can see it shining even from here. My goodness, okay, who's Dude. first? Oh, wow. Anna, you, you go first? Yep. Oh my goodness. Okay, guys, try to stay still, so. <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> it's very bright. Can I burn my eyes? No, it cannot burn your eyes. I will not Sunken. go into the physics of it. And that was pretty much it. So you saw kind of the, the atmosphere was, uh, was pretty funny. It was, uh, it was really awesome to be, uh, to be doing that. They featured a bit of that footage in one of, uh, of their videos. I'll put uh, a link in the description below. But it, their YouTube channel is not about astrophotography, but it's about Japan and how, you know, their, their fairly large family uh, survives <laughs> here. And... Uh, yeah, it's a it's a very very fun channel. So if you uh, if you're interested in that, feel free to uh, to watch it. Uh, but with that, you know uh, that's really all I wanted to share today. Uh, you didn't learn anything, I believe. But you know, I think uh, I hope it was fun anyway to uh, to watch. And again, Merry Christmas. And you know, uh, whenever you can, don't forget to look up at the stars. And I'll see you next time.